Hey guys, uh, just going to do another quick tutorial on Joomla 1.6 Beta 9. Um, I think it just got released like today, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and let's see, let's, uh, let's go ahead and minimize this a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Joomla.org. And yeah, I see that Joomla just came out today, so Joomla 1.6 Beta 9. And you can download the source here. And what I do is I just always um, download the zip package, and I have it right here on my desktop. So I'll go ahead and close that. And uh, we'll leave that one open. So now that I have it on my desktop, you just double click on it and open it up and it creates a folder with all the contents that you need in it and if you open up your map or your htdocs folder sorry in your map uh, htdocs directory you can go ahead and just put it in there I already have mine we, I call mine Joomla 1.6 1, 1 B9 for beta 9 so that's what I called it and you go to uh, your local host uh, map of course, if you're running MAMP, and go to PHP My Admin. I went ahead and added a database, but you can just add a database by clicking here in the Create a New Database field. And I always make the collation at the very end. There's a UTF-8 underscore Unicode underscore CI. So I went ahead and created that already. Now I'm just going to go to my local host directory. And I'm going to click on Joomla 1.6 B9. And we're going to start to install it here. And I already did a, a previous installation of 1.6, but uh, I think they've changed a few things and it looks a little bit different. So I just want to walk through it again just to make sure that um, it's all the same. So localhost is usually the name of the uh, host name. I have my um, my username here and password and database name is Joomla 19 or actually 16B9 and you can change the prefix to whatever you want uh, I will leave it as JOS and we're gonna hit next here Now it's asking me if I want FTP enabled. I don't, so I'll just leave that and hit next. Site name, testing, my email, admin, at admin.com. Username, we'll, we'll go ahead and change this, and that's good that they actually added this. I don't think this was added before. But we'll put administrator instead of admin. And I will set a password. And I'm going to go ahead and install the sample data and hit next. So now it's telling you to remove the installation directory. So I'll open up my htdocs and go to my Joomla. Where did it go here? Open it here. Joomla, 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 Joomla. There it is. Installation. Move to trash. Now it's gone. And we can go to site. So there we go. There's Joomla 1.6. And that actually looks pretty good. This is my first time installing it. Um, when it's this far along so here you go you've now done an installation whoa that's not what I wanted to do so you've now done an installation of Joomla 1.6 and of course you can always go slash administrator to get to the administration panel
and hit login. And there we have the administration panel, which looks kind of familiar to the last time I installed 1.6. So the only thing I wouldn't do at this point, um, I don't know when you're watching this video, but right now it's in beta, which usually is not recommended to go on a live site, which I have not used it for a live site. I've only used it as a test site. Um, but I'd recommend not putting it on a live site at all because there might be some security risks that they just haven't found yet or whatever. So. That's totally up to you if you want to do that, which I would not recommend doing it at all. But um, here we have 1.6, and I've already walked through most of these um, administration panel menus. So I'm going to go ahead and log out. So if you like this video, go ahead and subscribe, give me a thumbs up, or even write me a comment and let me know what other kind of videos I can make for you. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later.